Well, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Um, thank you again so much for joining us today. This is our fourth in the Real World Learning series of events. Um, I'm Lucy Evans. I'm the Chief Customer Officer here at Frog, and you'll have seen from the agenda that was on the screen earlier. We're joined from we've joined from uh, many schools today that will be um, sharing their stories, their ideas, and their um, anecdotes and today's overarching theme is overcoming lost classroom time and addressing the gaps in attainment. So just a quick bit of housekeeping. Uh, we will be taking um, a break during the day, during the morning, sorry. Um, we will be taking a very short break and um, on the right hand side of your screen you'll see a chat uh, facility. We won't be using the polls or anything like that today but please uh, do keep chatting and as the guest speakers join today, um, feel free to put questions in there and as and when I can, I'll be um, posing those questions to our speakers. So just to let you know who's going to be here today, um, we have, we're going to be joined shortly by um, Dr. Mick Walker, who is the Vice Chair of the CIEA, but also we have um, Joe Hawker from Davidson High School for Girls in uh, West Sussex. I can see um, Andrew McDonald Bowyer is also here in the audience. Uh, Vicky Pritt Roberts is joining us from Ellesmere College. Um, Andrea Robson, the head of primary at St George's in Madrid. Uh, good morning, good morning all. Um, Sophie Bailey will be joining us to um, run the panel session, which is straight after our break today. George Bly from Greenshaw High School. Tizzy Sylvester will be joining us from Frederick Goff School. And Mark Anderson, our very own ICT evangelist, will be joining us uh, for the session, which is Observations of Real World Learning, which is um, a new uh, a new session and it's uh, about recognizing all of those schools that have been sharing their best practice through the last year uh, and it's really about recognizing those schools that have been helping to form this community this global community of schools wanting to share amongst themselves so as you know you don't need to have frog to be part of this frog are just the facilitators um, of a global community of schools just sharing really 